you already know what it is, man. It's that boy Punch. I got I got beautiful women with me. I'm going to let them introduce themselves. Mm. Well, goddamn it, baby. I am your lovely Misty Stone, and I'm shaking them dreads. Shaking them dreads. Yes. Right. This is such a new book for Misty. <laughs> and what up, y'all? Chanel Hart. I'm always here. Same seat. Hasn't changed. All right, now. <laughs> I get it. Girl. How are we feeling today? I'm feeling good, baby. I'm walking. I know. I am walking, and she that's an accomplishment, again. baby. Mm-hmm. All right, so let's let's just dive in just in case they don't <laughs> let's know. Let's dive in. Why is that a big thing? Like, what happened to you oh, a couple months ago? Hmm. A couple months ago, about five months ago, yeah. <laughs> when I was uh, after my bed rest and such, I was before that I was hiking, hiking and I yeah. kind of just, I basically, mm-hmm. and it was a, kind of a freak accident because it wasn't that serious. It seemed like something that I could just put some ice on and just go home and I'm good the next day. But uh, obviously it was a little bit more extreme than that. So I twisted my ankle Yeah. when I was walking. I, one thing, kids at home. Because this demographic is tons of kids. So all these kids at home do not drink champagne and uh, hike. Oh, it's a bad idea. I didn't know that part of the story. I knew that you were. So you were drinking and hiking? I had my dog with me and everything. So you had a dog with you. You were drinking and hiking. This all sounds like. And a a dumbass bitch. And you're not athletic. A dumb person. (laughs) Stop. Because that dumb person is the reason I went on that hike. You know how somebody asks you a hundred a million times to do something and you politely tell them no? Yeah. Eventually you finally give in because this motherfucker won't stop telling you, mm-hmm, asking you, mm-hmm. I want to show you something, Misty. I want you to see how, it's like my backyard. It's so beautiful and I want you to see it. And Monkey wants to go for a walk. That's my dog. And Monkey wants to go for a walk and she just will love it. And I'm like, all right, fine, bitch. I'm going to go. Okay. So, so we it's a shut her up. It was a shut, a shut her up. up. And I broke my freaking... Well, I fractured it. So when I was walking, I was literally like five, ten feet Mm -hmm. from the exit. You could see the streets, the cars parked, everything, baby. And I'm walking, and I don't know, I honestly don't remember if Monkey kind of pulled me, but I slipped on the gravel. It was very like, I don't know, it's kind of uneasy and unsafe. I probably shouldn't have been hiking there. So, uh, yeah. It was one of those rugged trails. And when I twisted it, I decided because it twisted to the left that I was going to twist it back periodically within six, seven hours. So every hour I would like stretch it to the right because I don't want to look deformed, guys. Yeah, but but do you think that was what made it it worse? Yes, that is how I got a pilon fracture, which is how it broke and spiraled all the way up my fucking leg and into itty bitty pieces like Humpty Dumpty. So they had to go back in there and put me back together again. All the king horses and all the <laughs> king's men <laughs> couldn't put Missy together. Well, they put Missy together again. All right now. You is, but now your foot inside of your foot looks like um mm-hmm. looks like Robocop. Like you're like a she's like an adventure. She's all the pictures. Guys. Yeah. I seen the x ray. She saw the pictures. It's crazy. It look it does look like Robocop Robocop. I'm a, a miss Mrs. Yeah. I'm trying to be a Mrs. So Mrs. Robocop. Okay. okay. <laughs> but now it. you're better. Now this is five months later. Yeah. How you feeling today? I'm feeling good. I could walk. You have two I can shoes. Go. I have two shoes. I do not have a boot. <laughs> they have something called an air cast now. So it ain't no cast. It ain't like a, a you know, that ghetto shit. Well, if you, mm, if you got county insurance, you might still get that shit. Jeez. It's real life. But if you have um, personal insurance, like I do. Huh? <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Um, you can get an air cast. And what air cast is basically like a cast. It's like big ass boot. And it has these suction cups that basically have this plastic around your foot inside the boot. Okay. It's like a pillow of plastic. And it's, it sucks up to make it stay. It's crazy. Okay. It's some weird shit that some I never. Some high tech shit. High tech shit. And I now your foot's it. better. And my foot's better, guys. Yo, I is... talk like you. Right, listen, I'm Nigga. not. Ma- <laughs> listen. <laughs> I'll people- tell you a whole goddamn story. <laughs> Look, listen. The people wanted you here for a long time. Mm. And they're like, we bring you up, and we get tagged, and you get tagged. I get it. Like and then everybody, yeah. yeah. Just and you know, I can't help but to mention you. You know, I we talk about you. things, we talk about stories, and I'm like, yeah, Misty, you know, because this is, this, you're it's like, my dog. dog. Yeah. yeah I like, feel like you're going to knock that champagne down. All right, well, I should hurry up and drink it then. All right. I mean, like, sure. Cheers. No, he don't want me to be that bitch. <laughs> cheers. First you episode, I was super drunk. She was super drunk. She was trying to lick my, she licked my face. she wanted to lick your what? She was daring me to slap her, choke her. But he still didn't. <laughs> but he still didn't fuck after. So it is what it is. All real. I mean, the, the people think different. 
people think way different. I'm a cool okay. kid. How you know what the people think? They be on, are you crazy? Oh my Big god, comments. they tell us all the time what yeah. they think. Unfortunately, yeah, they be like this. <laughs> unfortunately, stop fresh. Now you don't punch fucking right now. Yeah, people. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all is a mess. That's funny. I mean, that's how it's supposed to be. My supporters love me, man. Yeah, okay. I'm well, with that's that. Good. That's what's Our up. supporters love us too. They love Missy right Song. Mm-hmm. Nah, Missy Song, big love. I like yeah, like you love. get tagged. Don't give it to me, man. Like we posted the me. other day was like, yo, who to have a threesome with? And of course, Chanel nominates you. Oh, yeah. So we go to that. I win the award. <laughs> at this point, I put the we clip in there where I describe it. And then I called you like, Misty is like, ping, 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 ping. Like, that was funny, though. Yo, this is. Listen. I even commented on your Instagram. Yeah, I had like, to follow you, cuz. Yeah, listen. Like, this is a. This is <laughs> I'm a like, like this thing again. Your energy is like. You're charismatic. You Thank have you. a very, very, uh, like, happy personality. And in your work, you're, it matches. You're just bouncing around the fucking screen. I do bouncing all bit. over dick. Bouncing like, on his face. She's jerking it. She's I'm sucking it. I'm very bossy. I don't know about... I'm, I'm, I'm athletic. Yeah. No, you you're know. bouncy, sis. Yes. Yeah, I fuck you. Yo, yeah, Misty came in here with, like, a, four, a four-pack by accident. Like, <laughs> super-toned arms, legs. <laughs> And she's fresh off, I'm like, the hospital see. bed. Like, uh, athletic. I'm like, bitch, I've seen your scenes. Yeah, like, you are, you are, you are acrobatic. I am. Okay. I, I give see, it. See, our scene together it. was lesbian first dates. And you know she was the aggressor the whole time. I'm looking oh, all yeah. nervous and shit. She's just talking to me like, yeah, baby. It's intimidating. You be it's like, like it's, okay. I'm trying to get in your head. When? You win. She wins. <laughs> You win. You got in my head. Yeah, that like, scene was nominated for best girl girl scene. Yeah, like so, it's like it was. so. You know that. that whatever you do kind of like translates on camera very well. So like it just it just does your personality. Thank you, baby. Your charisma. Yes. All right now, you know what I'm saying. You know I think highly of you, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that shit is crazy. Like like you, you did porn for a long time. Was it is it as fun as it looks for you? Um, man, I shit. I've been out for five months. So, but it's. It's entertaining it's, for me. I love it. I enjoy what I do. I don't think I want to be anywhere else doing anything else. Now, I don't mind because I know I'm getting older and stuff like that. So I don't mind get going into mic, different, different aspects of, you know, the adult industry and different things like that and not being in front of the camera. But I enjoy what I do and I am, I look forward to being in this industry for a very long time. Whether yeah. I'm in front of the camera or behind the camera. Yeah. So. So you're just going to start, like, you're thinking that like, you're going to start shooting your own shit? Um, I don't know about... I've shot some stuff and didn't put it out, so I'm a bit of a procrastinator. We heard. <laughs> but, you know, I got some ideas, so we'll see what happens, baby. Yeah. It's in the works. I mean, you know, I got like you all up in my head telling me what I need to do with I'm my life. I'm just in here just trying to be a business. You know, I'm trying, I mean, I'm trying to inspire. I think it's trying to make big business deals with I think because people see you and they know how big you are. Like, you just... you. It's your presence, Misty. You know what I'm saying? Like, everyone doesn't have star quality. Like, that's not a common thing. So, for you to just have that star quality, it's like, bitch, do everything you can to be the best <laughs> you you could be. Yeah, I, I told you it was going down. I knew it was going down. And she caught it one way. Reflexes was that's on point. That's a good gif. That's a good gif. I'll take so, it. I mean, I, I, all right. People get very nervous when they hear certain words. Mm. Do you consider yourself like a legend? I suppose, yes. What a I do. Um, yeah, I do. I, I've been happy. People are nervous it. with those words sometimes. Yeah, like, because because you don't want to be the one to say that you are a legend. You want other people to do that for <laughs> you. You dig what I'm saying? So that's why people get a little nervous about it because they don't know if everybody feel the same way they but feel. You, now, I think everybody would, <laughs> would call you a legend. Yeah. In this but night. because people have done that to me, yes, I have been hashtagging Missy Stone Legend. And I just got my... Um, I just got indicted into, uh, is indicted. Hilarious. Indicted. <laughs> I'm indicted. Listen, <laughs> Misty had a couple glasses of champagne I'm in the goddamn already. Hall of Fame. <laughs> yeah. She's indicted. So I made it. <laughs> she was inducted. Inducted. That's yeah. the word you were looking Great. for. Thank she you. was inducted into the AVN Don't Hall of Fame. She's on her radio she show She finishes now. my sentences like, for she's me. She's on her radio <laughs> show. I gotta love her. How do you like the new Chanel heart? Oh man, I'm digging it. It is beautiful. Thank you. It's like a grown ass woman trying to soar and... I'm trying, y'all. She doing her damn thing. I'm she trying. at her peak. So she at her I'm peak. I'm digging it. I hear that hot shit. Mm-hmm. I'm just saying. And I'm I mean, proud. I'm, I'm trying to be my best self. I'm proud, like, mama. What is that? Thank you. I'm, pr- I'm proud. I'm proud, I'm proud. proud. I'm proud mama. She do. She been referring to me as her fuck. child, y'all. Because I ain't got no kids. <laughs> and I may not never have this. Okay, so you this can my be baby. my baby. <laughs> I'll be your baby. So can we get She into... raised me. She porno raised me. All right now. This is a, this is, I mean, I think it's a dope story and probably would never be able to be told in this authentic manner. How do y'all know each other? A little bit further than just, hey, met on the set one day. Like, 
I know well, the we story didn't. We didn't it. meet on the set one so day. So we're all ears. Yeah. I reached out to Misty. Yes. Um, I always, I mean, because it's her, that's the quality that I've always seen of her. I did a bunch of research before getting into porn, and I watched a bunch of interviews. I kind of did some stalking to some, some, to some degree. Big stalking. Uh, and um, she wrote me something so beautiful, and it was it was just like she knew what she wanted to do with her life. And at first, because, you know, sometimes when young girls come to me, I'm a little skeptical because I'm like, well, you know, you really want to do this, baby? Mm-hmm. Because, you know, these are going to be the consequences of it, your mm-hmm. family and all this nonsense. So, but how she felt about it, how she worded it. Yeah. And it was just like she knew what the fuck she wanted to do yeah. with her life. I, I felt very like, sure. Mm-hmm. You know, I always tell people I didn't trip and stumble into porn. It's something that I sought out and I kind of went for. And you know? like she said, she did her research. Yeah, mm-hmm. I did. Because I already knew what was up. I'm like, I already know who popping, who's not popping, where to go, what agents is who. Yes. It just, but, but Misty was just like an angel in my life. Like she just was, she welcomed me into her life with such open arms. Mm-hmm. And so many people don't do that because they're reserved. A lot of girls, especially women, they're scared someone's going to take their shine. Oh, they're yeah. scared about getting their mm-hmm. light dimmed and mm-hmm. it's just I just remember the first conversation she's like, like yeah what you doing cuz what you go ahead do it I said first I said oh my oh my oh my oh my goodness Wait, so she knew it was me yes yes because <laughs> you can't mistake that that's Misty's signature that oh my goodness that is like oh Misty, <laughs> I was I couldn't believe it. Like I was on the phone with like somebody amazing, but then she took me out, y'all. I was 19 years old. Okay, the bitch takes me out. I got a fake ID in the club. We got denied at two clubs. I'm like, well, fuck it, let's try another one. Oh my god, they got. Then the third one, the man was like, this ain't you, but get your fine ass in there. I was like, thank you. <laughs> I don't give up, baby. Yes, I don't yes. Give up. Then I remember us going to Roscoe's that night. And mm-hmm. listening to Misty talk to this other girl who was obviously high of prescription meds. And she was like, baby, baby, are you, are you here with us? And the girl was like, yeah, no, I'm like, I'm good. Like, she was like, I mean, cause I'm talking to you, but I don't feel like you here. Baby. <laughs> she, was not, she was not there. More so, of a story. She was not there. But, um, and then I remember that. I remember so many things about that night. Some guy came up to Misty and was like, yeah, I've killed so many babies watching you. Yeah. Wow. Thank you. Yeah, he did. Yeah. It was weird. <laughs> I don't remember that. That's yeah. funny. Yeah, he that's, did. A, that's funny. That was traumatizing for her day one. <laughs> <laughs> you did what? I'm not, I'm not <laughs> Wait, I do. And he was like, I follow you on Twitter or some shit. Yeah. You know, I could turn my phone off. Suave. It would be Suave. Triple X. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shout out to Suave. <laughs> Shout out to Suave A Triple X and this motherfucker. Gotta call a bitch. He asked me to check my mail. I ain't checked it in days. Shit, I check it when I check it. But he keeps <laughs> sending me a friendly reminder because I told him send me a reminder. That nigga said just a friendly reminder. You need to check the mailbox. <laughs> but so he know, probably asking me to check my mailbox. It, it's it's a unique thing. I mm-hmm. think that like the relationship we built, and even to this day, it's like she's like my sister more than anything. You know, like we've argued, we've had moments, oh, but yes. it's always been love in the air always. and. And I don't think it's been like that. Like, you argue with bitches and you're like, no, I'm done with this hoe. Like, I'm uh, na- I'm good. Sometimes I do that. There's mm-hmm. bitches I don't talk to to this day. I'm like, oh, no, no, no. And I'm something good. small has happened, you know? Like, I'm like, mm, I don't I fuck like with that. Character. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like the way you did that and you moved. And I don't feel like your life is right. That. So I think you need to get it together. But I do. I feel like you you came in and you rescued me out of, like, what could have been a very bad situation. Because a lot of times the girls will come here and they have this big dream and then they sent back home on that bus. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And she wasn't sent back home on the I wasn't Bitch going back. I ain't going back. <laughs> I ain't going back to the hood. <laughs> She's not going back. And here we are. Right? Yeah. How, how common is it? I guess how common is it that girls just can't make it? It's very common. She is one of the only that really soaked me up like a sponge and took everything in that I gave her and used it to her best ability. There's another one who's doing very well, you know, but... I don't know if she's that smart and soaks shit up like a sponge like this one. But yeah. I was about to say, who is she? I you ain't just gonna, you gonna just leave. And then you dissed her. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> she know who she is, though. She's I ain't my other baby. <laughs> yeah. You <laughs> <laughs> see out here birthing bitches, though, and just leave them. Hey, I'll like... leave them with their daddy. So, so who... <laughs> <laughs> Misty, with this being said, with I, the, ain't shit ass I, I wanna <laughs> I wanna hover back over the um the legend comment. Who yes. is I, I I I like basketball, right? Mm-hmm. So I look at it like this. We got we got the Jordans, then we got the Kobe's, the Vince, the T Mac, then you got the new shit, Carmelo, LeBron, Chris Paul. There's like draft classes. Who is the draft class with you in that time period? Who All is right your now. who is your starting is five, era. six? All like right. who is that? All right. Mm-hmm. Um 
it was me. I was with a lot of white bitches because you know. Well, let's just I shout was out only the-, the white. I was. I was. It was a lot of. I was kind of like the only black girl in my era at that time, and I got lonely. That's a major class difference. Though. <laughs> I got real lonely. <laughs> so it's okay, since I'm here now. <laughs> right. So um, so when you got like the me, backup, Tori Black, Sunny Lane, uh, Jada Stevens, uh, who else was in my era? Riley Steele. That was my bitch, cuz. Um, She's so gangster, bro. I used to fuck with these white bitches the yeah. long way. They yeah. was cool, cuz. And then when the backup of... Oh, Sarah of, Vandella. Oh, that's She was right. oh, yeah, yeah. She, she, she And she changed her name a couple times because the company tried to steal her name because she was contracted. Bitch, you did that. I still love you. Shout I love it. Sarah Vandella. And then when it came down to starting to get more of the brown help, mm. or, you know what I mean? Oh, yeah. It came yeah. with the business. Then it was Naomi Banks. <laughs> it was uh, Jada Fire, Roxy Reynolds. Uh, my mentor at the time was Vita Valentine. I don't know if a lot of people know about her, know she but is. she was popping back in the day. Her and Roxy was like mad cool. Like I used to just like look at them like, oh my gosh, that's I crazy. Be just like you guys, I want to travel with you guys. Be carrying their bags and shit. It was crazy. <laughs> <laughs> that was me carrying yeah. Misty's bags to the airport. Yo, y'all niggas treat us like oh, draft. Me, <laughs> hey, you yeah. gotta make it up in the yeah. world. I know who she is. So, oh, Pinky was around too. She was popping. We all used to live in this model house. Uh, Carmen Hayes. Hmm. We all was in this like little. We used, yeah, we used to have black model houses. Yeah, I know all these girls. We used to have black model houses. We had some time in high school. Talent agencies, you know, which we do not have anymore. Yeah, but yeah. we used to have that. Yeah, it was beautiful. It was fucking amazing. Up on that mic. It yeah. was fun, baby. Yeah, that's fire. Mm-hmm. You know, nah. put your mouth on it. Yes, nah. I do. Mm-hmm. I, mm-hmm. It's so crazy. You said Vita Valentine. Yo, we. Th- yeah, I threw a party bitch. when I was young. It's my I, mentor. We threw a party and it was like the coolest shit. We had a bunch of porn stars hosted in New York. And it was like hosted by Roxy, Candace, and, and Vita. Yeah, yeah, Candace used to be around. I remember yeah. Candace. Yeah. yeah. And that was it. And so when I seen Vita, I was, like, I was a young nigga. I was like probably like 18. With mm-hmm. Vita, I was, we was big hype. Yeah. That's what's up. <laughs> I like, like, no, no, we was hype. Look at him reminiscing. Because <laughs> that was like, we was throwing parties. We ain't really, you know, like we was trying to do everything. We did rappers. We did everything. And then niggas was like, we need to do porn stars. And then we did it with, with Roxy, Vita, and Candace. Fish and Grits. Fish and Grits. Fish and Grits. Because, nigga, yeah. Fish and Grits was popping back in the day. Yeah. They used to do like, it was like, I just burped. I'm sorry. It, the, the, <laughs> it. Just in case she smell it. <laughs> um, <laughs> they used to do like the rappers with the uh, porn stars. Yeah, and it was I did so a shoot for them. Fly. Yes. I did a shoot for them. Me and yeah, Jenna. They tried to come back. Yeah. Yep, I thought that was fly. Yeah. I was so jealous. I was like, oh my God, I want to do one. That's fly. I don't but think then they didn't come back. Cool. You know, they didn't come back. We could just do it right now. We could just, who's going to be the rapper? Why don't why don't it really, be like a you new know age plug shit though? Like why don't it be new age? Like like so what I didn't like with Fish and Grits is was they got a bunch of OGs like from like the old rapper niggas. But, but I when loved it, him. Do you know how much I love him? Who trash from? Uh, yeah, that was Jenna. Woo! <laughs> Lord Jesus, hold the will. That's Tretch. Okay. I'm just saying. Okay. That's but maybe like you and like YG or something. Something very West Coast. But I like Tretch. Or like Blueface or something. Okay, He's a Crip. Yeah. Like, like like some Crip shit. Yeah. I'm like, that. you know, that, that would that be would dope. That would be fly. That would be dope. That's kind of dope. Like Let's porn stars and new age and new age rappers. rappers is in, how many I mean, rappers is in this phone? Is that really easy? Of course, I for mean, me, we're rappers. Mover, yeah. Like we put, we put. Give me a real a... West Coast or a Crip nigga. I want somebody That's like, easy. like, yeah. uh, oh no, all you I know, know is Bloods from. The you know how easy it would be. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. You need to come home as soon as Bobby comes home. Big Crip shit. Missy <laughs> right Stone and Bobby Schmurda. Well, goddamn it. <laughs> hey, and she doing music now too. Yeah, Let's that's get it. a feature. <laughs> and I play too much with the music though. I need to like do something else. I don't know. No. I was trying to write in my bed and it just didn't come out the way that. Oh I... shit! I really want to hear this. What you, put, what you get? No, I'm not going to say it. You got 16 bars it's on though. My, it's on my phone. Listen. It's terrible. I would love to hear it. No. Missy. You're not going to so do it? All right. Terrible. You got, a, so you got I need, a moment. I need to... some real artist development in that stage. That's easy. Let's do it. And I know a lot of people was like, damn, that beat was kind of crazy. It was simple. But it's simple because I'm... It was my first time in the studio, y'all. You get Yo, what listen, I'm saying? It's fair. You know, maybe if I, I scoot I've, up. I've made a lot of rappers. About that? I've made a lot of rappers from, from very small to very big. Okay. Who knows? You could be next. I ain't going to Who knows? With her. You could be next. The last kid I was with got, got a, nice a little voice. popular. You know? And they counted him out at the beginning. I hate him. He was a Mexican with rainbow hair. I hate him. I hate him. <laughs> it was an interesting concept. He, <laughs> a little bit he, tur- he turned out to be pretty successful. All right now. I think I could do it again. <laughs> well, goddammit. 
But um, you got a nice canvas, right? I mean, listen, you you have you definitely have some stories. I got a shit ton of them. A shit ton of stories. Some of them I can't share with everybody. How common Man. was it? How common was it I on the lucky. come up for like celebrities? Because I, I look at it, everybody does this front shit, right? You ask people like, yo, look, porn. They're like, I don't know the girls. I don't really watch it. But we all know you're really lying. <laughs> and, <laughs> you know, it's like, you're lying again. You know what I mean? Sure. How common was it throughout your, I don't know, career, run, legacy, however you want to call it, to where like, the, the, the famous were dibbling and dabbling and on Misty Stone's ass. Oh, all the time, baby. Till this, Til this day. Till this day. <laughs> they don't stop. What genre is I the most been... avidly chasing? Is it a football, basketball, rappers, singers? It, it, it changes seasons. <laughs> <laughs> Not it really that does. Answer, though. <laughs> it truly does. It just changes seasons. Sometimes it's the rappers. Sometimes it's the singers. Sometimes it's the football players. Sometimes it's the basketball players. Sometimes it's them legends that you'd be like, God damn, you did what with who? <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. <laughs> you know, two legends together is kind of fun. I hear that hot shit. Mm. Yo, what's legendary shit? <laughs> she got me on the I got some right stories. Now. I'm gonna take them to my grave. Are we just gonna yeah, take, it to, gonna take it to the grave? Oh, that no, is a we good taking story. this to the Misty Stone Tell All book, bitch. You I ain't dying know. with these stories. You fuck out of here, bitch. I'll be old as fuck with a typewriter. I'm getting all that shit, okay? <laughs> we tell know. it. We get I'm loyal. I'll keep these stories till I die. She asked me to. <laughs> <laughs> I know the story. <laughs> Oh, that's I'm on the inside. Oh, I feel so oh, in so the that's inside. A, that's a common thing too. Yes. You get like women celebrity too. I do. I get couples, everything. I get oh them all. And I, 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 I actually prefer couples because I'm very good with making the woman feel very comfortable being in a setting with another woman. I know how to kind of shut the man out, but not make him feel like, you know, uh, hopefully he understands, but not make him feel not want it, but kind of shove him out and make her feel like center of attention because that's how you do a threesome. But you also Absolutely. can't like bring the moves. I ain't bringing shit. No, you can't bring moves. Like you I can't go in there. Make it you got to go in there like real basic. You got to be in there doing some basic shit. Like if Misty brought the moves to the threesome, there's going to you know be an angry what? girlfriend. I'm going to, I'm going to tell you something, baby. <laughs> it's not even about the moves. It's uh, sex is very mental. Mm -hmm. And when you can, talk to somebody and get inside their mind and tell them things and get kind of dirty with them and take them to another level of sex that they haven't been on and they feel very comfortable with that. Yeah. Um, they start doing freaky things that they don't even think that they knew they knew how to do. Or they even like. So you're just turning people like. out left and right. Mm, I do things like that. Yo, this is normal. I, do think she's a, I definitely think she's a mind fuck. I am a mind fucker, yes. So I, that's why, man, when I did that new scene with King New York, I was like, nigga, I got to find a husband like that. Mm. What the fuck? I might be their second wife. <laughs> she likes, do y'all need, need a housekeeper? <laughs> I think it's very unique though for like like a lot of porn stars like they have that unicorn factor like yes. you can go into a situation with a couple and like immerse yourself into it and you you make a woman feel comfortable and you mm -hmm. tell her she's beautiful and you yes. you fuck her and then the man is just he's like an add on to the situation. Oh, but he's loving it. Yeah, of course he oh, loves it. He loves but it. I think your role as a unicorn is to just make the woman feel comfortable by that. Because we know women are insecure and we know women yes. are most likely to pull back if it gets yes. if it gets too much. Like yes. you can't be more into the man than you are into the woman because yes. then that makes her <laughs> resistant. Like, oh, you trying to fuck my man? Or, Hence like, why I heard when y'all was talking about how you supposed to find the woman, how the man or the woman supposed to find a woman. Oh, no, no, no. Yes. You yeah. Are absolutely yeah. The right. women. Let the woman do that. And, and I say that because of the insecurity of a woman. Mm -hmm. When you are going and going out and seeking another woman and saying how fine she is, like you were saying, yeah, she gonna be a little insecure. Like, well, why is she so fine, nigga? Let her, <laughs> even if mm -hmm. that is your idea, be, mm, I hate to say this, but be a little manipulative to make it seem like it's her idea, even mm -hmm. if it is your idea. You dig what I'm saying? That's why I said. Because it's going to make her feel more comfortable in that situation. If she feels like this is something that you want and not something that she wants, it's not going to work, baby. It's never going to work. I'll write that down, y'all. Yeah. All right now.
So we giving out free game. <laughs> you're welcome. You're welcome, niggas. Yeah, right. Like this you're welcome. How to, how to get a three? Because I even mentioned Misty Stone. Because I even mentioned like it's okay to be like dominant and push her. Like you push her to find the girl though. Mm. You be dominant about her. Like find a girl. You know what I'm saying? But you don't make it seem like oh well, I want to fuck that bitch. Yeah. So you should just be cool with fucking her because I want to. Mm. That's like a no. Like yeah. and I'm a fucking porn star and I'm like fuck no, nigga. No, you don't need to fuck her. Like what's wrong with you? Because I get jealous you're too. Not giving, you're not giving Damn, the boo threesomes? Uh, am I giving like, the well, Why you like threesomes? that bitch so much? Yeah. yeah. What the fuck she got I mean, that I ain't got? The <laughs> only reason why I'm not crazy like threesome crazy is because I know what I bring to the table. If I was some whack bitch and my sex was average, then maybe I'd be more inclined to bring bitches I'm in because I don't, I'm not there. But I'm literally the icing on the cake. Like, I fucking do it all. So it's like... We bringing a girl in for extra ha ha ha. You know what? I, did, I, I didn't bring a lot of female ladies in my no. in, in my oh my goodness um, that champagne is delightful mm-hmm. burp me like I'm a baby <laughs> <laughs> um I didn't bring a lot of female lovers in my life I brought you into it of course yeah. um but in I don't know I I don't know why was I jealous no I don't think it's about being like that's how I feel like and I've told this to punch as well when we've had conversations I'm like I mostly feel comfortable fucking my friends yeah. I know if I have a threesome mm, with my home this girl is true. it's but gonna a lot be of my friends didn't like my nigga Shit. Who's so I was fucked up. I need you to not say that. No. <laughs> it was like, mm, no, Misty. Yeah. <laughs> Can I get paid? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I've also said me. that though, where it's like, well, you <laughs> know, me, you might have to throw some bread or something to him. But <laughs> even my friends who are down, it's like, I'd rather do it with them. I know you're not going to call my nigga later. I know there's not going to be no weird shit between us and me. You could talk and be honest with each that other and be like, bitch, this didn't feel right. This that's somebody good. that you trust and adore. And, and you know they're not going to cross the motherfucker. There's lines. already a foundation built. Yes. So yeah, I could bring you into on yes. this threesome. Like. Yes. That's how we work, cuz. It's, it's, it's a madness. Yo, it's a scientific yo, madness yo, yo. to our motherfucking formula. It is, it, is, it is a fucking equation over there. See, but, but, <laughs> but you're also a very lit nigga, so you've never even had to work for the threesome. Like, bitches was just like, cool oh my that. God, mm. we're going to fuck him. High five. And they all just oh, is did that it. What they be doing? Yeah, they high five, girl. Girl, bye. Carol, this nigga is lit. He you lit. He what? said all the time. He big lit. I got to make him climb like a motherfucking hill. <laughs> I'm climb a mountain. <laughs> what you? How bad you want this pussy? How bad you want this pussy? I'm gonna make this nigga climb a mountain. <laughs> you too energetic already, though. He already tired. He like, look, climb the mountain. Now, I, By the I time I get listen. to the pussy, I already came. Listen, bitch, listen, listen, listen. We can, I can. I can take Misty with one leg. <laughs> <laughs> Let me tell you something. I can take Misty with one no, leg. You a big motherfucker. <laughs> he kept suggesting I fuck he you with one leg. He was like, big. "Why don't we just go over there and you can him. just shoot like some content with her?" I was like. Well, he got a he got a handicap fetish. <laughs> <You're right. laughs> Holy shit! This Hold nigga on. got a handicap fetish. Uh, nigga, like, can you put your can you put your boot on? Right. <laughs> on. So you know, what I mean, Chanel was offside, presently pouring liquor, being right half now. naked over there. Oh, you wouldn't even believe. All right now, did you hear it? Uh, uh, all right, uh, all right. <laughs> it gets me excited. I'm sorry. So, um, question. You know it's like the most common shit right now, and I'm be honest, because now it just seems like, um, and I say it again, you know, I credit like I said, like when I was at This Is Fifty, we was like the first ones to really do like the porn star interviews. You know what I mean? Jack Dilla, Heineken, they were the first ones to do the pinkies, especially Heineken. I, I mean, I, I'm gonna feel terrible. Kind of like that fish and grit shit. To an extent, but they was doing like <laughs> video. They were doing video straight. Like it wasn't like oh, let's it was like do the interview. Porn. Yeah, straight up. Not like, like photo This shoots. is cor- this this is this is normal now. Okay. But back then it was like, whoa, you're like talking to Roxy, you're talking to Jada, yeah. you're talking to Jasmine, 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 and Monet Divine. These, she was popping she back was then. Oh, Jasmine. Uh, Jasmine. Yeah. yeah she was so like popping. all of this shit was going on where all of these girls are there and and now it's normal. Yes. Now that more porn stars have more voices. Mm, oh How goodness. are you feeling with some of the well, well, well? The I don't amazing think that headliners of... that that some of your peers and counterparts. I don't know if you want to ask me this question because I don't care to hear none of the voices. <laughs> it like bothers but you. Why not though? Is it? Is it? The, it's the image, right? Because okay, just let me speak for you, bitches. Because honestly, you make us look stupid. You make us look dumb. You make us look like all we want to do is suck dick and, oh my gosh, I just want to be in a five guy gangbang and it's but, the best day of my life. And her voice is sexy. It's as amazing. Fuck. And they say 10 guys now. 10 guys. That's like the normal now. 
And I don't want them to speak any English. That's my fantasy. (laughs) We're getting a little deep. But anyways, I don't care for them to speak for me because they so ignorant and dumb. Is sometimes it makes us look and it, it just like that Netflix film that they did mm-hmm. uh, with the porn stars. We've been pitching over and over again different reality shows, different ideas, you know, to different networks yeah. with different companies that got different type of money. You dig what I'm saying? But nobody is picking up these uh, reality shows. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But they'll pick up something on Netflix that basically degrades us. And shows. Wait, what's happening on Netflix? I'm, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm okay. Now. Hot Girl Wanted. Yes. Um, it basically talked about this guy named Riley, who is um, a manager at like Hussy Models. But, so this like, is a real thing. This yes. is a very real thing. Okay. But you know, Hussy Models isn't one of the most like they're not very popular within our porn not industry. Not at all. They're kind of like a side. Like how I dare they say speak that, but, for us? Yes. And it was it became very public, and a lot of people stood behind it. But it's like. It was weird for us because we're actually in the industry and we know that that guy is not reputable. We know that that's not the guy. He fucks yeah. his talent. No one fucks their talent. It showcased a lot of girls from the Midwest. Well, I don't know were... nobody fucks their talent, but yeah. Well, I mean, a lot of a lot of agents I've met don't fuck their talent. Like that's not what they're doing. Sure. I've had like three agents since they maybe have... you don't well, know. They just didn't fuck you. <laughs> maybe... They didn't like me. I guess I wasn't the yeah, one. But they fucking. A whole of them is fucking. Okay, anyway, continue. <laughs> continue. But the point is, we don't want those type of, we don't want that to be the idea of porn. We don't, sometimes we don't want to just shine the light on the negative of porn. Maybe we can shine the light on the positive of it. Or the women that are doing a very entrepreneurial things. Yeah. Did I say that correctly? Yeah, you did. Mm-hmm. I'm a you little did. Uh, tipsy. I mean, it's the third bottle, but third glass. Third, third, it's third. okay. So, but... What I'm saying is I want us to focus on the positive side. And for some reason, when we talk about porn in particular, yeah. and we're putting it on a big platform like yeah. Netflix or, well, we'll never, obvi- well, not never, but we obviously not getting a platform like WeTV or Oxygen or anything yeah. like that on the, um, you know. Network television. I get yes. what you're saying. So I just think that it's sad that there are depicting us in that way so all right so and let they me, don't want to come and talk to the girls who are actually doing something in the business who are the girls who are successful winning awards and and are happy in the business they're talking to the people who are just starting or just are, are just sad about the business i feel like they talk to a lot of girls who've had bad experiences yes. and they want to hear the negativity yes i don't think that they want to um i don't think that they want to shine the light on it and they don't want to make it a positive thing mm-hmm. it always becomes very negative yeah you know so and that's it. some bullshit cause. And that's some bullshit because I've met women like Misty. I've met other women who are very happy and very secure within themselves and their indus- in the industry. So it just, and I, I know, know that it's not the real thing. It, this is my opinion. But I think that it's because society is not ready for porn to be a light shined on it. You know, they want to look at it as a downfall. And they yeah. don't want people to try to get into it. So they don't want to. I think it's shock. more appealing. Yeah. I think it, I think to them, it's more appealing for it to be a negative thing versus for it to be a positive thing. Absolutely. And, and we're already crossed. We just got through with the whole stripper barrier. You know what I'm saying? And it took like, uh, and it, oh took, boy. it took pioneers <laughs> like Cardi B in order to push them and be like, no, I'm not just a stripper. I'm yes. not just a dancer. I'm this, this, and this. So I think it's still something that's still being worked on, yeah. you know, like, but it's going to take women like you, you know what I mean? It's and you, take, baby. Thank you. It's going to take women like us. With this you know platform what I'm right here, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> we should, I'm trying my to do my baby doing best. big things. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, we've had this narrative a lot of times. Yes. So I just think that at the end of the day, it gets to the most simplistic form. Until the masses can see success come from something, they don't believe it. Yes. Hmm. And we just got to look at it like rap was a bullshit genre until someone made money with it. You know, and then West Coast rap was trash until someone made money with it. Then it's like, oh shit, here we go. And then there's Drain and there's NWA, then the East Coast shit, and then it goes to the South. The South can't rap, and then comes Outkast, and then Luke, and I mean, it goes on and on and on. That was out of time frames because they'll pick a nickname. But you get what I'm saying. My whole point (laughs) of the matter is like, until we see the success story, we go, this is bullshit. Mm. Man, like, I'm kind of like we that gotta too. Look, we got to look I'm at it like a, the social media stores, the mm-hmm. social media stars, the, yeah. the YouTube stars. I mean, yeah. YouTube stars are literally making 10, 20 million dollars when they got 10 million, 20 million subscribers. Mm. That's normal for them now. 
You get what I'm saying? But again, it was a joke. Like a lot of people look at the Instagram girls and the social girls like they're a joke, yes. but they're legitimately now making successful businesses out of it. That's interesting. Now, this True, triggers yeah. Chanel Hart's oh, bone. Right go. now. Let's Let's get get it. This Let's triggers her. <laughs> but there are social stars now, yeah. I don't know if you are aware, that okay. have massive followings mm -hmm. on Twitter, YouTube, oh, Instagram. Millions of right? followers. And now they're now, we got Bang Rose, we got Brazers or Brazzers? How we said Brazzers. Brazzers. Brazzers, Naughty America, Reality Kings, all of the big homies are literally throwing big bags. And I'm talking about 30, 40, 50 grand at YouTube girls Allegedly. for one fucking fuck scene. Allegedly. I mean, all of the... All Allegedly, 30 well, grand. God damn Allegedly. It. Yeah, she continues to not believe this. But yeah, this because is, now, I think a lot this of is this a real fact. Now, I, I don't not believe it because I've been here a long time. I know I look grand. young. 30 grand. 30 G's, my nigga. What but are you doing for Some that? of my friends did they first anal for 30 grand. <sighs> nigga, get your life. Yeah. Jesus Christ. Nigga, back in the day, we would start at 1400 for a fucking anal. Nigga, yeah. it was real life. So, maybe 1400 they are... 1400 or 14,000? Four, oh, 14,000, I'm sorry. Oh, uh, I was like, <laughs> sister, that ain't a lot yeah. of money. <laughs> 14,000, I'm so sorry. I, okay. I, I yeah. mixed up right, my zeros. Cool. Right. Yeah. But 14,000, and that's how they would start. And, you know, I don't know why that era was like that, but there was an era where we were doing our first, first anals and I was starting because I was a black girl, you know, so we can't start that high. Uh, I was starting at 11,000. I was mm -hmm. like, well, if y'all pay me 11,000, I'll do it. And nobody didn't want to pay my black ass 11,000. Yeah. So I never did it. So that's why y'all never seen Missy do an anal scene. I'm and sad. now yeah. it is that error has gone, mm -hmm. but I could believe but, but that. But I feel that like it normalized because it, like it influx with like every girl. It ain't like, like that no more. It. But anal now. Scenes, if you're doing your first anal, you getting like 5,000. No, mm -hmm. hear what I'm saying. I'm not they even, I'm, I'm not even, it's not to compare it to that now, but now that there's this presence of women coming in with a level of celebrity, not talent. Nobody They're eating out of the off window. of us. Sis. They're literally coming in with oh, a level. I see. So they don't fuck. I see. This is a girl. I take panty pictures every day. Mm -hmm. I may, I might vlog on YouTube. I might do all of this, right? And, if I and then now, and now, Bang Bros is like, look, I'll give you thirty bands to come and fuck once. I go beat that bitch ass. <laughs> yeah, I'll beat that bitch ass. That's why it ticks me off so much, though. Yeah, so she's yeah, super, I, I get I, it. if I find out that. that I'll no, be this at is Bang Bro set. This is and I will beat that bitch ass before the scene. <laughs> I'll be right Listen, there with her. Let me I'll see her right do a winner. scene after this black eye. Yeah. <laughs> I put my boot on her face. <laughs> I put my, my good foot. Oh, you got I, boots? I, oh, your, your yeah, cast. My cast. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad so we're keeping this on. No, let's keep this fun. Let's keep this yeah, like, because no, no, you know no, I get no, hyped no. every episode when yeah. we talk about this I shit. I to, because you said that, so I know what to do. Yeah, because yeah. I it, can't. It, it, but it, it, it got to be. I'm a mind manipulator. I listen, I get it, right? <laughs> She's in here. I know what to do. I ain't going to have my baby It bothers me. It bothers me that women will will eat off of our industry and then not try to claim that it's sex work. Right. They will legit be like, oh my God, sex work? Porn? Oh my God. They'll look I did down. one scene. I did one scene. Yeah. I'm not a porn star. They'll sure. But they'll disregard everything we've worked for, our name, our brand. These are our companies. Li li well, there's women in the industry that have been in the industry and then disregarded after they get out the industry. Yeah, they so can let's do that keep it too. 100. I mean, they, they can do, do that, that all the time. And that honestly, but at least that's so disrespectful. Bitch, but at least that's a bitch who been through something and now she feel like that. So maybe her experience was different. I dig it. All right, but I'll you mean that. to tell me a bitch who ain't I'll never stepped foot into an award show? She ain't bitch, never you can't been. Say a, shit. You can't. You can't <laughs> say that about it. All right, I'll take that. I'll or take eat that. off of That's us justified. because now you're like, oh well, I did that one scene, so now I'm gonna just show my pussy on OnlyFans. Well, you're a sex worker. Hmm. I hate to bring that to your attention. <laughs> That you think just because you're on one platform showing your pussy that you're not a sex worker. If yeah. you're even selling the idea of sex, you are a sex worker. Yeah, That's just... That. and But it's like something we always talk Somebody's about. Somebody's really intelligent. <laughs> <laughs> I My mean, baby is gay. I know it. what the fuck I'm talking yeah, about. Like, I'm I've been it. around the sex industry long enough. I've been... I know prostitutes. I know porn stars. I know strippers. Like, I, I know this. Yeah. I know that we're all selling the idea of sex or selling sex. Like, and that's what you're doing, and that's what you're doing. Sex Period. work. Like, it, you don't get away from mm -hmm. that. Period. The moment we start losing rights, you're going to be upset, too. This is how you eat. Just imagine they ban porn in USA. No so more now cash all apps. of our social... No. <laughs> no, no, no. But now all of our Instagram stars are gone because now we be banded it in the U.S. There's no more porn allowed. You don't make money still, bitch. You showing yeah. your pussy on OnlyFans. It's a wrap for it's you. It's my bush next to the bush. I got a bush. You got a bush? I don't have a bush. Oh, okay, I got. A bush. I just saw that she on has Instagram a bush. the other day. You should like see the bush. It's I saw bush. that on Instagram. It was, wow. it was like a regular girl 
and she was like showing her bush, but it was like her panties, so you can't see her pussy, but just the bush, and she was next to a bush. It's very interesting. Wow. <laughs> you know what? That's, that's so innovative. You know what I'm saying? That's just I so it creative. It was very interesting. That's some crazy shit. Yes, baby. Um, it's just crazy. Is there, is porn as racially hype, like hyperly racial? That's probably not even a word. But as as it really just seems to where everything is just black, white, black guy with That's how white it is. girl. Is, just, is it just, uh, it's because of our consumers and people don't understand that. I know they think, oh my God, porn is so racist. But it's not that porn is so racist. It's the consumers that's buying it. Are so or, racist. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're, no, the customers are yeah, racist. Yeah, it is. So they're looking these up, these things up online and they're categories, category. Hmm. Categorizing. Fuck. Yes. Thank you, baby. They're doing that to us. Understood. <laughs> I'm with you. And... When they're doing that, they're looking at these categories and they're saying, oh, my God, okay, so I'm going to look up big black butts or I'm going to look up, you know, um, little white girls with big black dicks or, you know, or I'm going to look up, you know. It's a common category now. It's a very common category. I just laughed about it. I thought it was funny. I mean, but it's different type of taboos that they're looking up and it makes us have to stay in this box Mm -hmm. of shooting these special things because this is what the fans are looking for. Do you dig what I'm saying? I get you. Okay. I'm with you. I just didn't know if it's uncomfortable being in your seat where it's like, oh, look, black girl, I'm going to bring you to fuck white guy. At first it was. You get what I'm saying? Like, at first it was, but it became a norm now. It did. Because I'm not, I'm so used to it and I've been doing it for so long that now it's normal to me and I understand why it happens. Before I was kind of upset because I was young and dumb and didn't understand why I was being put in these type of scenes. Yeah. But now that I understand why, I'm okay with it. Yeah. Still, mm-hmm. it's not okay, motherfuckers. <laughs> um, but I'm okay with it because I, I got to make my money and pay my bills. I get you. So I'm going to do that scene. Uh, there are certain scenes and certain lines that I will not cross. Certain scenes, like I will never be on Ghetto Gaggers. That, uh, that'll be a never. Yeah. Um, Why though? Because it's I get very, it. It's disrespectful. It crosses the line. It's crossing a whole bot- bunch of lines. Because it's, I'm not about to be throwing up on nobody's dick. I'm not about to be doing all that. And being like you're a ghetto crackhead yeah, hoe. Like you got me fucked up. Cause so no, none of that. If they would have gotten me when I was 19, <laughs> might have been a different story. But they did not. They called me when I was 25. Yeah. Can, I, can I make a comment like about the racist thing though? Like I think that um I think as a person who's worked in the porn industry and it has been racial, I think that the outer the outer thing of it being a racist scene, like okay, say for instance, like the scene is just like black dot com. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? So you know it's interracial, but it doesn't Low, have to be cute white girls with big black dicks. But it doesn't have to be. But I've also been on black dot com as a black oh, woman. Shit. Yes, with a little white girl. Yeah, and, and a big black dick. Yeah. But but, <laughs> but my here. whole point of saying this is that it wasn't a very racist scene because it was a black man in a suit. It was something professional. Like now they we, are very classy. That's different. But see, a lot it's but a lot different. more companies I feel like are like coasting into that yes. that that thing where it's like yes. it could be interracial and it's race changing. but it, it doesn't have to be super racist like you black bitch you black whore it doesn't have to be that narrative they're making it more elegant yeah more and beautiful. more acceptable you know what i mean like mm-hmm. it could be taboo let it be taboo sex is a fetish it could be taboo but it could still be beautiful yes yeah absolutely okay i dig that it doesn't that. always have to be this raunchy big black guy and this is a new era that we're coming in keep in mind i'm old school so but i you, remember but you've been through changing the years. confederate flags and the bitches sucking dick because that was me i was sucking dick it was confederate flags so i remember a lot of different things but now that you know black.com is showing something oh good catch mm. after it's something this, totally different in life i'm gonna go ahead and finish this um this is gonna get us big flagged is that's it? gonna get us flagged is it I don't think so, but oh, we're gonna probably have to edit a lot. She has her butt. She has a very big butt. Have you noticed? I have. Do you, do you, do you, do you, as she's down there, do you, do you, do you, do you prefer? Be careful on my foot. Do you prefer, like, you slim Chanel or thick Chanel? You know, honestly, I think I prefer thick Chanel. Oh, oh God good. damn it. Thick Chanel gets us flagged on YouTube. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> right? Clearly. That's who I prefer. I prefer the one yeah, that's yeah. naughty. I became a woman now. Yeah, yeah, she did. 
she did. And I think it's beautiful. I just grew up. I love it's it. Dope. I think it's beautiful. Honestly, my head was too big for my body the whole time, and nobody told me. So. I hate her. It yeah, just I is what it, it is. Happens, right? I hate her. I seen those pictures, sis. No one told me my head was that big, y'all. They was just letting me be out here with a big ass head <laughs> and a little skinny, weird body, <laughs> and then it, it never matched. She was so tiny and so cute. Yeah. Is it, have you ever Have you ever done a scene that you were like, I really wish I could delete it? Hmm. Of course. Absolutely. Don't um, you have days at work where you wish you could just not have went? Got a disease. And I was like, oh my God, I wish I never went to that set. Oh, Jesus. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> whoa. whoa. <laughs> I did. Whoa. Vivid. Thanks, Vivid. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thanks for giving me so chlamydia. Cool. No, I'm just kidding. No, it was. Jesus Christ. It really was. Yeah, so. <laughs> is, that, is that a common thing or no? It is not. Um, most of the time we are very responsible. When, mm -hmm. And now, back in the day, we used to test every 30 days. Now we are at the status of testing every 14 days. So it's more uh, controlled. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And we make sure that if there's any type of um, outbreaks that we shut the whole industry down mm -hmm. and we'll quarantine everybody and test everybody multiple times. I've been in a quarantine before. You know, things happen. Mm -hmm. You know, this is a risky business. Baby. Mm -hmm. So if you are not going to be equipped for a risky business, then this might not be something you want to do. Mm -hmm. yeah. But so yeah, I've been quarantined. Yeah. Oh shit. Does it? Does it? Does Lucky it, bitch. <laughs> 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 do you um like like looking at it now? Looking at it now. Yes. What what's the next? What's like the next shit for you? Do you go back and start shooting for these big companies? Do you want to only? Do you not want to shoot no more? I don't even like, know what I want to do when my leg is fixed. I have no idea. I think idea. she just want to run for now. I want to <laughs> run. run. I do want to run. Yeah. I do want to run again. But when my leg is fixed, like, do I want to go back to doing porn? I don't fucking know, cuz. Do I want to rap? Do I want to fucking act? Now, acting is my passion. Mm -hmm. I love acting. Anything okay. about acting, anything I can do, voiceovers, that type of situation, I'm with it 100%. Yeah. So that's my passion. Yeah. That's what I would love to do. But I got to pay my bills, baby. And I've made a brand. I've I've built a brand. I haven't made a brand, but I've built a brand, and I've become this person. And this person has constantly brung in this revenue of money. Yeah. And that's what I eat off of, and that's how I pay my bills. So, if I eliminate that person and decide that I just want to be an actress, you know, why can't I just be an actress and that person? Why can't you be both? I don't see what's stopping you and what's limiting so, you. Yeah, I just yourself right now. I just feel like I just want to do it all. I'm yeah. weird like that. I'm not. I, I don't. I'm not one of those people that want to be put in a box. I'm very talented in very different aspects, and even if I try something one time, I'll be like, "Damn, that's popping," cause. But so I just the, the I'm thing go. is like this. I'm gonna go. This, this this brings us back to ten minutes ago. Mm. They're never gonna let you do multiple things until someone magically become super successful with it i do it no, all but the hear time. what i'm saying once it happens and it becomes solidified like look i'm successful with this and that then you break down the barrier for everyone after you you mm -hmm. get what i'm saying the way like you're like i act and i do this and i do that you get what i mean yeah once it gets to the position of where you're like yo i want to do both i'm gonna do both successfully all, at the highest there's rate a few of them you get what i'm but i know but more reasons of what i'm saying yeah. once you get them to where it's like this is running at 90 boom acting's running at 90 boom it is. Fitness is running at 90, I'm a whatever thespian. this thing is. But I but think, that, once life. it happens, Did you it come goes. see my show, nigga? But I think that a big point of, like, I feel what you're saying. Like, I totally agree. Like, you should be able to do everything and go to. hard with everything. Because but I don't you know, know what, how to you just know what I remember a conversation thing. I remember having with you, I know, Misty, we had this conversation. And I was telling you, I'm like, if you feel passionately about acting, you need to go and put yourself out there. You need to go and put yourself in front of people, go out, shake hands, kiss babies type of shit. Seriously, because that's what you go, yeah, That's what you need to be doing. But yeah. just imagine if you actually put in that effort, because you already get calls because you missed these stone. Yeah. So just imagine if you put in that, that little bit of work, that little bit of effort, and put yourself out there. Nigga, shit. Will be I ain't gonna lie. The booming. only the only reason I have taken the roles that I have taken is because these directors or these producers mm -hmm. of these mainstream companies or mainstream you know theaters yeah. have reached out to me and they were like, oh my god, I'm a fan and I would really like you to be a part of my project. Yeah. I'm like, okay, yeah, sure, I love to, but. She right. Someone yeah. has if I to put some motherfucking effort into it. Just cause... imagine your kid. You're, you're, you, you are you're you literally shit. limitless. And that star quality mm -hmm. that I speak of can just be in so many different things. Yes, girl. Put your life I, together. I need to get my life together. Yeah, you're talking to me and get my life together. Shit, I'm trying. You got it together. I'm work, no, I'm working on this. Still process. You at the peak. 
I'm mm, doing it's real a process, good. but I know that you have that star quality. So I know that whatever you decide to do, I believe in you. And I'm like, that's my, I see, fuck us being friends. I see the star quality. Thank whatever you. she do is going to be successful. Whatever she do, and she puts her best effort in it, it's will work. It, yeah. it will work. Yeah, that's G shit. I it will it. work. So if you want to be it. Misty Stone and your other person. And but I wanna... do, I do do that. Now, when I am introducing myself into mainstream, mm-hmm. because I'm not ashamed of where I came from. Yeah. Because I'm from the hood. I'm from Inglewood, guys. So... I'm not ashamed. I got a gang bang. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm not ashamed of where I come from. So I feel like when I am entering into the mainstream world, I'm still Missy Stone. Yeah. You're going to put my credits as Missy Stone. But you know what? Stone. I heard you earlier mention Period. that you shouldn't have told your physical therapist what you do for a living. Shit. So there is that, that, <laughs> means, that means that there's a time and a place to display it. your authentic self. Everyone doesn't need to know that right off the bat. I you walk it. into these auditions, fuck that. No, be your fucking who you are, not mm-hmm. Missy Stone. Be your regular ass self. And then once they earn that right and they earn that trust, then, they then can you know tell. Yeah. yeah. I dig it. Fuck proof. You don't have to prove shit anymore, yeah. bitch. You already it. dope. You already lit. Prove what to who? But I just want to make sure in my credits it say Misty Stone. Because I want motherfuckers to know. You, put, you write that on the paper, honey. Because you write that on the paper when I, they put your stage name. I love my industry. <laughs> I don't shine. Sh- sh- what is it? Shun. Shun. <laughs> I don't have a good vocabulary. It's okay. Um, I don't shun my industry at all. I just feel like it's where I was. You know, I'm a hood bitch. So when you born, it's where you from and it's how you live your life. So if you're going to fuck with me and you're going to book me, you're going to book me as Misty Stone. Misty, everyone doesn't deserve that loyalty. Not even a hood. Period. Where the hood then? I hate her. (laughs) Where the fucking hood been this whole time? This bitch so loyal. Okay, I hate her. Yes. So where the hood? Where the hood at right now? Because your leg was fucked up, bitch, for a few months. Where Where was the hood? hood? Where is she going? This is good. This is that's a screenshot. (laughs) Where was the hood? Where was the hood? She's so committed to the motherfucking hood because I was born there. Where was y'all at when my bitch was hurt? Did y'all donate? I did bet y'all? you a, a couple niggas donated $5. $5? Bet you they did. Yes. Nigga, my mm-hmm. publicist donated $25. 20 <laughs> I hate them. I got you, sis. Don't worry. Mm-hmm. I can't This too. bitch made me. I live. Oh, I oh. paid my bills. <laughs> $25. Fuck a $25. That's what you do for your friends. And you know my rent is hot. Yeah. I but live I in also, penthouse in I Hollywood. I'm able to do that because I know you do the same Ooh. for me. Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I raised them good. <laughs> Just know that. She's stupid. I can live. <laughs> I, I'm with you. I love her. I'm with you. So I asked this to loosen it right back up what? before we get out of here. Uh-huh. Um, and, 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 and very fun and much light, lighter hearted. No, um, no. <laughs> if you could just snatch up, I don't know two celebrities and just have like this dream threesome that you could have. Hmm. Wow. Who would you snatch up out of the air? A dream threesome. Can they be dead? Let's go with a live so that let's go with live so that they can at least like I like think, it. But if they famous then I think it's okay if they If they dead right. they can't hear it. Like I dig it. at All least right. at least get some alive dick or uh, Oh my god, stop it. You want to make a real fantasy happen. I mean, it's, could, uh, it could. Listen, you pop it enough know. to where like you call this out. And post it? <laughs> Girl, man or female? Like, Oh, my goodness. Okay. I'm so old school. <laughs> Who the OG? <laughs> okay, you guys shaft, remember. Right? <laughs> I hate them. <laughs> like I said, she loves Shaft. She wants Shaft dick in her mouth. So, but no, I don't want Shaft stick in my mouth. Um, I actually know him. Um, <laughs> um, I like that guy from that. Why do fools fall in love? Oh, Lorenz Tate! Lorenz Tate, girl. Okay, I love Lorenz Tate. So if Lorenz Tate would call me, oh my God. I would be your mistress forever, baby. Oh, my God. I would oh fuck God. your mind oh Listen. and suck your dick so good. Can you just call me after? Like, forever. are you going to make him be Frankie Lyman? Because I'm just like. I don't know. I'm going to make him be Frankie Lyman. Call me after. Mm. I'm going to be one of your wives. Minister <laughs> Society? Man, Remember he was a gangster? He's just such society. an amazing actor. I just love him. And I aspire to be an amazing actress right. like him. So, so you? And then I want to suck his dick in the process. 
this. I'm not mad at this. This was an awesome and thing. I might so do it for free. Third, who, 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 I don't know. I think about free. it. It depends on how fast he answers. If he answers too fast, I might not. Okay, so we gotta play this bitch to the left a little bit. Okay, that's what we need. I'm to one do. of those bitches. You I wanted to, to work to out for Lorenz, so I'm because I want to say it for free. I might. So who's the third person? You, Lorenz, Tate, and who else? would Because I feel like somebody sensual and very beautiful, like a Nia Long or somebody, would be like a good like She's addition beautiful. to that. She's you know, beautiful. like somebody kind of. But I've seen her a real. Hmm, I shouldn't stop. Say stop. No. 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 Acne ain't no joke. Sheesh, man. Who's the third? <laughs> God damn it. Who's the third? Hey, shit, guys. Who's the third? <laughs> Wait, I got this new artist. She fly as hell. Okay. A little thick bitch. Okay. I'm an annihilator. Oh, I know who that is. Mm. Who? I don't know. She sings so good. She make me feel good. Who, the light girl? Sometimes I masturbate to her videos, and it really ain't right. It's disrespectful. Because she singing? But yeah, because she's singing. Who we talking about? The bitch on Instagram we was just looking at. Oh my god! Wait, because she do this thing with her body sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> this girl's innocently singing songs on Instagram, but she got misty stuff. What's her name? I'm an annihilator. That's her name. Anaya. Yeah. Anaya. Yeah. A lot. Anaya. A lot. Anaya. 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 Whatever. Whoa. Whoa. I fucking misty like her. Your box. I want that box because it's very nice. Smells good. It, it looks like it smells good. Okay, because I was about to say, so what the fuck you been doing? Hold up. Hold it. Cause we've got a, What's your... The Halle Berry porn. Did you name yourself that? I did not. Hustler did. Hustler. You gotta let it's somebody else do it first. <laughs> and then you come back and hashtag it. I get you. Mm -hmm. That's fire. Yeah, that's how you do things. Because otherwise, you're not relevant. If you do it yourself and say, oh, I'm this, I'm that, then you a faggot ass nigga. But if you let a motherfucker, your other motherfuckers, everybody around you who love you, tell you that you are that motherfucker, yeah. and then you hashtag it, and then you good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's how I do it. I love it. Do you do interviews or podcast and shit often? I do. You uh, do. Uh, very often. Very oh, so often. you're big, Bob. Uh, I thought I you were do. special for like two minutes. I, I've gotten uh, a few <laughs> offers to do some Playboy Radio, some Vivid Radio, and have my own show. Not just being on their radio show, but having my own show, so... And even some XM radio, so yeah. But I it's am not online. I, online. I am not on time. <laughs> so everybody would be waiting for my podcast or my radio station to be on, and I would just play. Slow it seems jams. like a lot of like, like you're just holding yourself back from your own greatness. Well, God damn it! Mm. All right, Aladdin. Aren't we all our worst this enemies? The, what is that nigga who played the genie? All right, Will Smith. I didn't <laughs> see it yet. The movie ain't even came out yet. I'm just saying, cause yeah. this nigga want to be my genie and shit. Don't I can fix my shit. I'm out here just fixing yeah. shit. I'm over here just fixing shit. I'm you a fixer? Shit. You I'm like fixing. broken things? Obviously. Right? I don't know. You're a very I interesting I, character. Okay. I don't know. Sometimes I have to. Uh, I like to read people, but I can't read you yet. Why? I feel like you're supposed to have a motive, but you act like you don't. So it's, it's interesting. I'm going to read you later. A motive? Why is everything a motive? I don't know. You got a motive. What you want from me? From you? What you want? Well, mm. I mean, you've already what like... What does he you, want? You cause. popped up already, so it's kind of like... <laughs> Did I say I'm going to make him climb a, climb a mountain? A mountain. Climb he, a mountain. Yeah, he should climb the mountain The mist. Like, like what, we'll what, what Which we'll mountain see. is this mountain? It's, a, it's Not one the hills snow. one. Yeah, it's got not snow the one on it. she fell off. Uh, Wait, which, which mountain? It's got snow. I don't know, because this inside It's a big ass mountain and it got snow. And it's real misty at the top. Sometimes the clouds oh, be. Oh, the misty mountain. <laughs> the misty mountain. Uh, yo, sir, when it's I tell y'all was slow, they're the going to joke me. The clouds Punch be on the top of the mountain. You like didn't know what they the were snow. talking about. I was just like, <laughs> I miss this one. It was Make just a, a huge for inside it. joke. It was yeah, just fuck a it. Huge the misty mountain? mountain? This is cool shit. Let's I climbed ahead. the mountain for this hoe. Oh, right now. Okay. She did. I would. Freezing cold. I'll be out there like. I love her. I'd climb it. Teeth chattering. Yeah. Ditto. For misty? Yeah. Ditto. Wow. I do it all Climb day. Climb the mountain, and then when I get there, I'll call. And I don't really like it when it's hot, but I do it in the desert for you. That's, that, oh. that's, pretty, that's, some, that's some crazy <laughs> shit. I really like you it. You know what I'm so saying? I'll find that cactus, pop it open, and give me some water. Oh, shit. <laughs> Just to get to Chanel. Yo, I'm not, yo I want to ask. This is going to be a mad funny question. <laughs> I don't know why. What's up, did, baby? What is the craziest thing that you've ever done for dick? Hmm. With this bitch? No, 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 no. <laughs> Don't involve me. No, 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 no. I wasn't right, there. No, no, no. It. it wasn't me. <laughs> no, 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 no. I forgot y'all fucking. All right. Um, whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Yeah. It's okay. I might that. fuck him tomorrow. Shit. Yeah, yeah. Everybody's <laughs> fucking. Yeah, this is... Are you fucking? Because I'm fucking. There it is. With the bad leg. No. Right? There I it fucked is. three niggas with my bad leg. I wanted to at talk about time? that. Well, I didn't do it at one time. I wanted That's to talk up. about that. I did do that for my birthday, though. I love to have, like, a couple guys for my birthday. And I like for them to fight over me. So then they all come in the room, and it's like, I have all these guys. Like, it's so fun. So it's a plan? Yeah, I do that every birthday. No, 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 this is your plan. Yeah. Are they in on the plan, or do they just oh, all... No, you be like, yeah, just... pull up at eight. Well, but then I, I have really... a party. No, I have a big party. You Come know up how to the I mic. Do. Come up to the mic. You know how I do, cuz. Okay. So That's I have it. this okay. big party. I'm, a, I'm into orgy parties. That's something that I used to do. Anna Fox is taking it over, though. She's the new. Miss, she getting it down. I don't know. I, I don't, I don't do the orgy parties I wasn't no more. There. I, wasn't I wasn't there either, there. but I heard. So if we wasn't parties, there, it wasn't popping. that popping. But I heard it was popping. All right, well, fuck it. Subjective. Well, she used, she popping. She was popping, but I was doing the orgy parties back in the day. Explain to me this orgy party. So, and usually what I do is I have a big party and everybody usually knows that it's usually going to turn into an orgy because it's a lot of porn stars and we're tested and things of that nature may happen. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe there'll be cameras, maybe there won't. I don't know. So in that event, I will have a couple of guys because it's my birthday and one of them wants to come in my room. Maybe another wants to come in my room yeah. and you know, they're porn stars. So it's not a big deal. So maybe one of them comes in my room and then the other one's like, man, fuck. Let me in a room too. Cause. Niggas would literally <laughs> knock on Missy's door. <laughs> Why are we fucking? <laughs> like, yeah, what's up? I mean, I was just Can wondering. I get in too? So I'm like, all right, fuck it, cuz. Wow. It's my house. It's my fun. It's my birthday. I could do what I want to do. I think birthday dick has been a very significant theme on our show recently. Like, I think a lot of girls say that they're like, for my birthday, I want multiple dicks. I like, did. as if there's dicks with little bows on it or some shit. Like, I don't, I don't I know what the, the hype is. to be friendly with each other. Look, a bitch like okay, me could just... you be nice to the nigga that I'm fucking on the, on the side? A bitch please. like me just trying to go to Jamaica this year. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't need multiple dicks. Like, I just want to go to Jamaica. That's all. Like, I just want to get drunk on a beach. That's oh, it. You're so simple. That's sweet. She's had her years with the multiple dicks. I dig Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Somebody likes attention. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you know, I've had my fair share. Okay. But I mean, I feel like in particular, on occasions, I like to have a birthday present. Mm -hmm. Do I care to have that on a regular basis? No. I'm pussy my hurt. Mm -hmm. Might be too much for me. Um, but on occasion, I like to feel like I'm the center of attention, yeah. and this is lovely. Cause and it's my birthday, nigga. What the fuck you mean? And it makes me feel good. Like, I got control over these niggas. Like, I can have four, five niggas, and they just do whatever I, I say. I, I kind of understand I that like aspect it. of it. But I've, I just invite the niggas to my birthday party and see what happens. But I don't know about fucking everybody, but y'all can all come to the birthday party and see what the dynamic now, is. Now, in my personal life, I haven't fucked more than two guys. Isn't that crazy? Tell me that ain't sad. I don't think. It's kind of sad. I think that when you're like, oh, multiple guys, I know you, Misty. Yeah. You are my picky. Person, like, fucking yeah, for free. You are a picky Two bitch. You yeah. are like, no, that doesn't work for me. No, your dick's too big. Like, her pussy's like this tiny. Like, it's a little tiny pussy. I'm like, nigga, I don't know if you deserve this pussy, cuz. <laughs> Not today. I love it. I mean, yeah. Climb a mountain with some just, snow. You ever just fuck with the bandana on? Oh yeah. Oh, this is this oh, is. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh I hear this. Oh my god, and they funny. You're like, they like, like a crypt. Like they a, love a dream. it because they like oh because this is the real you. <laughs> I get to fuck the real you. Nobody gets to see you like this, but no, me. I'm not talking about like the head top bandana. I'm talking about the flag, like, like the, the crypt like bandana. The low flag this on. nigga's Hi. like, have this you been? I have this little. Uh, All the popular lokes follow me. I this might. Is it. Like I might it. have. I might have. I think GS9 would love you. I have to think about it. I, I think know. you should do that, though. That would be That'd hilarious, be though. Yeah. That's kind of Get you a little blue flag, put it at the top, cat. Like, oh, Yo, you're going to do it. I want to <laughs> produce, the I wanna produce this, this Crip Naked Misty shit. You <laughs> go Naked super, Misty shit. Yeah, this is, I promise. I'm, I'm with listen, it. Let's do I'm it. sanctioned enough to be able to do this. It's lit. <laughs> it's lit. Shake them dreams. Yeah, Mad Computer is playing in the background. It's lit. Hey, that'll be good. We'll have a good music. You'll go super for... viral. Like you by see that's the shit I'm talking about. But... Like I'll be knowing how to listen, Misty. And then tomorrow Stone, I'll be smoking too much weed. You'll be like, my, why, why Misty won't pick up her phone, guys? Look, listen. Oh my god. She sleep on the couch. I know what she doing. The bitch got a million followers. Why the fuck she won't pick up her phone? <laughs> I know what she's doing or if she smoking. don't pick up. She's sleeping or smoking or both. Or playing space. Or falling asleep with a blunt. Or a blackjack. 
pla- blackjack dominoes. and spades. And I'm Domino's. She knows me. Oh yeah. my gosh, she knows mm-hmm. me so well. Yeah, I mean. Yeah. <laughs> All games I can't play, so yeah. I know. She don't. I just sit there You're and watch. You're not a real black person. Yep, because I'm not black. (laughs) You have blonde hair. This is an act. Yeah, it's all an act. (laughs) I'm really tan right now. What black people don't know how to play spades and dominoes? The black person who was always getting told, get out of the kitchen because you ain't no adult. So get your ass out this motherfucking kitchen. Honestly, it's the new generation because you're a new generation. They told me to get my ass out the kitchen, bitch. And y'all don't know how to play spades? Y'all don't know how to play spades and dominoes? You don't play spades and dominoes, cuz? I'm with the business. Why don't you know how to play spades and dominoes? Because they kicked me out the kitchen. I keep saying I, it. And you're not you. listening to me. I'm going to need your mama to, to the teach you. On. You ain't a lot around grown folk talks. Go Do ahead you get know? Out of here. I'm going to tell y'all a little story, cuz, and we could cut this shit. <laughs> My grandma <laughs> is such a fucking hustler, cuz. Um, she is, she actually is a little senile right now, and she can't remember my name, but neither nor here nor there. That's Misty sad, maybe. I'm sorry to hear that. Bro. My great aunt, ain't John May. is crazy. <laughs> But we used to gamble together because my auntie was the shit. She my great aunt. We'll call mm-hmm. her grandma, Grandma Jana. But we used to gamble together. Yeah. We used to like, she would wake me up in the middle of the night, like 11 o'clock at night, 12 o'clock at night. I'm supposed to go to school and shit. We gambling because her friend's like, oh, you can't beat me. She's like, my little nine-year-old granddaughter will whoop your ass in space. Nigga, I get up, wiping the sleep out my eyes because come down the stairs, whoop them old people ass. <laughs> In dominoes and spades. Yeah. And rack up all that money and go to bed. Got candy in the morning. Nigga, what? Got candy in the morning. I'm just saying. She, she took, took all the, the she bread. Took the she took the bread and was like, here's Here some miss you. Here's a now and later and, 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 and a starburst. I was happy with you that now and later and that starburst. Starburst. And, and it's coming out the bra. And it's coming out the hands. It's, it's five dollars. Yep. Mm-hmm. Here you go, baby. <laughs> my grandma ain't shit. She used to steal my money. <laughs> go gambling and shit but you know it is what it is gambling little family but that's how you learn spades and dominoes this bitch don't know shit about spades and dominoes I, I can play tonk go fish I can play tonk that's some Pittsburgh uno <laughs> I can play uno I'll be your ass uno all right now I'll play anything if there's like a gamble if we could like play let's play for like clothes you know I've never clothes. played strip park or- Poker, but that's kind of interesting, you know, because you would think a porn star would play that shit. But I, I don't know how to play strip. poker. I don't think I want to play poker. Never she played. just wants to strip. Chanel is extremely horny. When we like stop shooting, she like walks around naked all the time. And I have this habit of doing moans whenever I feel goofy. It's just like oh. she just starts like. <laughs> Oh my god! It's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Oh, you thirsty? You want some fucking juice? I'll give you some fucking that juice. Actually, sounds. I'll good. put something so wet she looks in your mouth. In the eyes. She sounds tries good. to seduce me. Oh, I do that. Yeah, it's a good thing. It's a good habit. I don't it fuck is. with her. That's good. She, I don't fuck with her. I, don't, I ain't looking her in the eye. I'd be damned if I, I look her in the eye. He's looking away like, please stop. Yeah, I'm not <laughs> please stop. He don't want to be hypnotized. Yeah, I'm in here trying to produce. Because pussy will hypnotize you, baby. It will? Mm-hmm. It pussy can have that. you fucked up. Mm-hmm. I think dick does the same thing to yeah, women. Yeah, but you didn't though. answer. What's the craziest thing that you did for dick? You didn't answer. Mm, and I'm we trying can to avoid like the question, but shit, fuck it. Yeah, let's spin back. Have you ever went out your way for dick? Have I? Hmm. I probably have. I feel like you the type to show up, act crazy, and then take the dick. Yeah, I did. I did. Okay, I'm going to tell you our story. <laughs> she was just weighing options. Yeah. I was like, well, which story do I want to tell him? Um, I had this boyfriend, and he had this baby mama. Mm-hmm. And they was real close. They was real close. But we was fucking. We was together. We was together, and he still had the baby mama, which, you know, he's still fucking the baby mama. Okay. Um, so, because that's what you guys do. So, um, I don't even have no kids. Man. I don't care. I'm, I'm fucking, looking at I'm you fucking the and baby I'm, mom. I don't I'm think I don't being kids, very I'm derogatory mom. towards you. I'm with you. Because you are representing it for all of men. All of it. I'm six for six. I'm in a different yeah, class I, of men. I guess. So, but, <laughs> so I basically, I don't fucking remember the story. How funny What is did that? you do? Some nigga, his baby mom, what you do? Oh, yes. Okay. I smoke so much weed. Yo, that's 420, Missy Stone, We do this way. all the time, though. She's amazing. She, like, finishes yeah. my sentences. Yeah, and stuff. Yeah. Um, so... I fucking am angry because this nigga don't show up. I'm like, cuz, where this nigga at? Mm-hmm. This nigga don't show up, cuz. But we so cool. We got a cool ass relationship because I'm a cool ass bitch. So I'm the type of bitch that go to the hotel with the jacuzzi and shit. So I know what type of hotel he go to. I know where you're going, cuz. That's the spot where we go to all the time. So let me check this spot real quick. I don't know why I decided to check this spot, but I decided to so check this spot. You went up to the hotel? I went up to the hotel. 
And I went to the front desk and I told them I was I was his wife because I'm ignorant. So I'm his wife. Yeah. And um, I need the key to go to his room. Yeah. And they wouldn't give me the key. Right. Because that's <laughs> against the law. Thank God. Yeah. But. Good job, Motel they... 6. <laughs> it wasn't Motel 6, you asshole. I'm with you, I'm with you. <laughs> but um, they did give me the room number. Oh, boy. So I went up to the room and I'm banging on the door, cast like, nigga, I know y'all be, I know y'all in there. She said it so nicely. (laughs) Banging on the door, cast, banging on the door. And uh, the bitch answered the door, cuz. You raggedy bitch. So it's his baby mama to answer the door. So I'm basically, I don't know, I ended up fighting with the bitch. I ended up fighting with the bitch. Smashing. Smashing. We, Man, when you upset, time. everybody get, get the fade, dog. Everybody. You, 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 the and cast, you. <laughs> the cast will be on your neck. So I'm fighting with the bitch. And I don't remember the moral of the story, but I ended up fighting his baby mama in the hotel. And uh, was it There's no moral. This was just to go out of... I kind of attacked her. Okay. I kind of I don't see her fighting back. No, she was with the business. Okay. Oh, yeah, she mm-hmm. was with the business. I fuck with ghetto bitches. Okay. Yeah, All right. Yeah, they Keep the, continue. They not scared. They're not scared of me. You, these bitches ain't intimidated by me mm. in the hood. No, 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 no. Yeah, she's slim. So they think they can take her. <laughs> yeah, they, they. But they don't know business. that's. Bing, 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 bing. <laughs> that's Misty's sound effect forever. It's like a bing, pinball bing, machine. Bing, 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 bing. Y'all bitches think you can take me. Ping, 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 ping. Yeah. Yo, listen, it's so, scary. It was a ping, ping, pong match. Okay. Did ping, I win? Ping, Did you pong. fuck after, though? Did you fuck him after? They probably fucked after. But How that's ignorant a- is that? I mean, that's me so tight. That's what it was. Oh, you showed up, bitch. I, I would have sh- fucked everybody. They everybody can fucked die. After. Cause he left. He left me. He like fought with me. Got upset with me. Left me and went back to her. So they probably fucked. That's crazy. Yeah. You know, you out here doing Baby crazy mama. shit for dick. Baby mama got more clout than me. I'm out here doing crazy for shit for dick. Oh. Fucking bitches I've up. Some, Fucking baby mamas up. I've had some fights. A couple of them. I was hmm. there. Damn. <laughs> We don't talk about that. I was about to say. <laughs> I was about to say, look, we're just going to leave my shit on reserve because you know what? This ain't my interview. I'm this always ain't here. This my interview. So I don't really need to explain myself. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm a co-host. I'm with you. So we don't have to explain She was trying to impress her mama, but boy, it went way left. <laughs> I'm just saying, though, it wasn't my fault. Even it wasn't my fault. Point. I feel like she, well, she did. She attacked me. Yeah, it, was, it was her okay. starting it. She and happens. I just finished it. So it just is what and it is. And she definitely finished And she it. left and she got booted and the girl got booted out. See, so. her ending ended a little differently than mine <laughs> did. <laughs> That's crazy. But you know, we that was so embarrassed though, Missy. Ooh. That night, I was so embarrassed. I, know, I, I was know, like, baby. "This is like when." It, first of all, I invite my superstar porn star friend to come and with you... me, and I get into a fight about some dumb day. shit. It was really dumb. Lord have mercy on my what, soul. The, the, see, like the crazy stories about like just doing wild shit for the dick. I I can imagine what confuses me the most with girls who do wild shit is that it, see, like your story ended there. You get what I mean? Like you wild explosion. <laughs> Damn. And he was like, did your, fuck that bitch. Did your story well, end there? Mama. What do you mean, did it end there? Mm, then that means it didn't I end I mean, there. I wasn't the girl that got kicked out, if that's what you're saying. <laughs> no. <laughs> but, <laughs> no, I was the reason to say, like, it wasn't me who got kicked <laughs> out. Just, it it could have ended if me and Missy would have just left, but I wasn't the ending. No. Mm. No, it didn't end right there. But even her story but didn't end right there. Yeah, but that's like, oh, that's what I'm saying. Oh, so you still talk to him after that? Yeah. She still talked to him for years I, after that. I, did. Oh, I see, still yeah. talked to him. Yeah. So this these girls out here doing crazy shit for stupid. dicks. Hold on, time out. Yeah. What have I've you been done talking for to pussy? that nigga. He from Venice Show Line Crip, cuz. Let's go. That's my nigga. I fucked with him the long way. Okay, so. Shout out, V. So we all know what we have done. <laughs> but what about you? I feel like men do crazy things for pussy all the time. I feel like niggas have acted wild. Niggas broke our phones. They act a little stupid. Do, oh, break my computers? All kinds of shit. Little baby nigga. Oh, <laughs> she went very specific. So go ahead. Why don't you share a story with us? Because I gave a little insight on mine. All she right. shared hers. I would love to. So hear what's it. up? What you do for pussy? That had you what just like do you do crazy for the pussy. I don't. What did I do for pussy? I, I what don't have repeat you done? the question back. I'm thinking it out. Sometimes I'm thinking it around. It. No, I'm not gonna get around it. I'm thinking. I, I don't really do crazy like shit. Just watch. I don't do crazy shit. 
So you mean that? So you never done me. anything crazy for anybody's pussy? So you, you haven't? Like, 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 so you like, ain't no, no, you no, ain't no, choke no, a no. bitch up? You ain't ran up on her? You ain't bust her shit open? Like you ain't bust her phone open? You ain't never gripped her up? What you done? Because I'm thinking about a big public thing. I think probably like the wow. Like I, I, I was always so stop can, tiptoeing. Can I, no, tell lying. us the can, fucking can, can truth. I'm, I'm, lying, I'm not cause. lying. I'm not lying. He's, he's I've always been in my own shit. So I always feel like anyway. Like tell us what you did crazy for the pussy. For the pussy, I, uh, quit lying. I think probably the wildest shit that I've ever been through. I I, I was with a girl mm-hmm. and um, fun tag team. Yeah, no, nah, that's cool. That like tag teaming by Misty. Stone <laughs> you was Snow with Hall. a girl. Stop distracting this man. No, I'm going. I think probably the, the wildest <laughs> shit that I did was probably I was with a girl and she was like groggy and woke up out of sleep and called me another nigga's oh, name. Oh really? And you still fucked her. No, 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 no. You stopped fucking her. Yeah, we kind of oh, got a into a physical. Oh a my physical god, you thing. and your feelings. No, he slapped yeah, the did. shit out your of her. Your dick don't talk for you. Your mind does. Yeah, I, your heart. Listen, oh my heart. Bitch, just imagine some nigga call my heart. Out. Call out. It was just. It was just kind of. But I'm no. a woman. No, but hear what I'm saying. He's it was a just, man. It was just kind of like listen. groggy. It was just like uh, I'm like yo, what happened to you? And it just let's just I'm making some shit up. But this is what happened. It's just like yo, my fault, Kevin, and be like. Kevin. Action. It went to action. How dare you call it me Kevin? Action. It went to action. Boom, boom, boom. Dragged by the legs to the door. Oh, wow. Okay, so we did this for pussy. Because that, <laughs> that was your pussy. And she just was calling out another nigga name. So it was about the legs to the door. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bitch, yeah. get out. But like the wild shit, I've always been so on it. Like to be like, I'm never going to let somebody get me out of public character. I dig that. I, be, I swear to God. Like there's no like public outburst where it's like, and Punch was there yelling. Nah. Fuck. Like, I've okay, always been on my, even when the girls there, I'm always like, wait, people can see me. No, I'm not going to do it. I'm always super reserved. I'm always thinking it out. Interesting. And then especially in the last probably like 10 years, I haven't even gotten to the point of getting even like to really, like to really grab up a girl. I wouldn't even do it now. I'm so controlled. I've went through some of you the most hardest things in my entire life. And I've been able to reserve all of my temper, anger, and frustration. Well, 100%. Obviously, Chanel and I'm, would like I'm, you to take it out on her. Right, because Chanel's a. <laughs> that's just kind of my thing. Well, like, she, she, that's she, my she, thing. High five. Where's like, take all you... your anger out on me. I am like that. I don't like your fucking purple flowers. <laughs> I want the yellow ones, babe. When I get home, you better punish me. <laughs> <laughs> I be on that shit, though. I'm definitely like, I deserve it. I deserve it. Fuck me up. I deserve it. Sorry. Like Ignorant. We ain't got no sense. Listen, this is like. a crazy This was fun. Like. Missy, I'm so glad really you came fun. on. You're so funny. You Missy is great. No, you're, you're a great. baby. Personality. Mm, oh oh my God. Okay, one more. Oh my goodness. One more. This is the last one, I swear to God. Pull a titty out. Like, if we're going to do this the right I way, pull it out. I love her, cuz. That's my I'm going to pull a titty out for these behind the scenes shots. You know what I'm saying? Get your I'll touch her titty. Our titties, our titties coming out for behind now the scenes. Now she wants to promo. <laughs> now she. Yeah, now. Because now I'm about to be on my business shit. Can you go to my OnlyFans? And can we just tag Misty, you guys? Like, tag her. With my dress. Misty Stone 420? Yeah, her tag's going to be all through this, though. Okay, like, perfect. Like, literally. The tags come up every minute. Oh, my goodness. And I'm verified. It's really me. <laughs> <laughs> Did you get one, oh, too? I'm the the Look at all the black okay, people that are verified. Children, We're that's, going to get you. That's our thing, right? right? That's We're gonna our get thing. They told me I got to wait 30 more days. That's okay. You're going to get it. You're gonna get Thank it. you. I, I know you so. are. I, you're doing big things. I'm trying. I'm trying. Brats. Well, listen. <laughs> I can't you wait to be bratty. You two I know. verified people, you about to be lit. All right, now. Yeah, this is the interview that makes my whole life <laughs> crazy. I've never been around so many blue checks at once. I'm a star. Okay. I'm a star now. It's lit. I love but y'all. Tune in, homebody. You had fun? Yes, I did, baby. You had That's fun. Crazy. My favorite part is just when two of them are on one of me. He got fantasies. Mm. He got handicap fantasies. Remember we talked about handi- that earlier. Fucker. This handicap. He want me to wear my boot. <laughs> I'm a whole Misty's boot Yo, while if, he fucks. If, if Misty I'll be comes like, with a keep boot, keep it real still. Stay still, bitch. I'm like slow listen, strokes punch. Listen. I got a few niggas strokes. that's like that. They be like, they like me to stay still. No, no, no. Move. no, no, no. Listen, you can bring all. I got the, a lot of fetishes. You can bring me all the like ping, 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 pings you got. All the ping, 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 ping. That's it. We got. And we out. Climb the mountain. <laughs> With the snow on it and the mist. Cut. Listen, I gotta do a commercial. Keep that shit away. Listen, it's the Homebody Podcast. New episodes all the motherfucking time. I'm telling you, speak to them. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> if you like what you see and you fuck with it, then subscribe.
You just gotta always do your own fucking way, man. Whatever. I Bye. want to. Yes, my way, the highway. I love it. Ah, shit, I do. What is? <laughs> yeah, that's good. All right. He liked it. He liked it. He really, really liked it. <laughs>